Hey guys, it's Mark from Team How To. Our team has scoured the web to bring you the latest and most relevant content. If you find this video helpful, please remember to like and subscribe. Hey guys, it's Mark from Team How To. In this video, I'd like to talk a little bit about what long tail keywords are and how you can find them for free. With this ever-changing marketplace, most, if not all, of the best free options for finding and researching long-tail keywords is really just no longer useful, or they've begun to charge such steep prices that it's really hard to afford. If you're making good money marketing your site or channel, it might make sense to go ahead and pay for one of these services, but if you're a small channel or not profitable enough to afford it, you just can't really justify that kind of cost. First off, let's just talk about what long-tail keywords are. They're basically search queries with low individual search volume, but when put together with multiple words can garner a larger exponential search demand as a group. Long tail keywords are keywords or key phrases that are more specific. Long tail keywords get less search traffic, but it will usually be higher conversion value because they're more specific to what that person is looking for. You might think that shorter search terms will get higher volume, but actually longer keywords don't always translate into lower search volume. It kind of depends on the specific case. In some cases, you'll find that adding a modifier or extra words can increase the search volume. A good example of this is lose weight. You would think that lose weight would be hard to outrank, but according to one of the expensive keyword services, how to lose weight and how to lose weight fast are searched two to three times more often. So now that we've established what they are, let's see why we would want to use them. Long tail keywords convert better because they are more specific to what the person is searching for and long tail keywords rank higher in the search results because they are more specific and thus weed out the people who are not searching for what you are offering. For instance, if I have a video about weight loss cookbooks and my keyword was weight loss, I could be paying for traffic from viewers looking for weight loss coaching, weight loss workout programs, all kinds of stuff, just on and on. So one last final note on what long tail keywords are and are not. What long tail keywords are not are really long words that are keywords. What they are are three or four keywords put together to create a single phrase, thus a long tailed keyword. So let's get into a few examples of what long tail keywords actually are in practice, and I'll show you a few free ways to go about finding them. Uh, the best way by far, I think, personally, is to come into the YouTube or the Google search bar and just type in the, the, the primary keywords you're looking for. In this case, let's just do lose weight, and you hit the space bar, and you can see these are highly searched for terms. And these, these, as the terms evolve, these will evolve. If losing weight fast is the most uh, highly searched today, but maybe three weeks from now, it won't be. So you come in here and you see what most likely people are looking for. And uh, another great uh, way to do this is to come in and after the space hit A, and this will see what, um, what people are searching with the A. So lose weight at home. Let's try B. Lose weight by walking. Do the C, lose weight by lose weight cycling and college, all these possible terms that you can use. And you can just simply go write an article around that or find one that fits your specific article. And that's really just the simplest possible way to go about this. Now, let's just say you've put uh, lose weight fast in here and we hit enter. Uh, one thing that I truly love to use is this free Google Chrome extension, vidIQ. And you can get it by just going to the vidiq.com and then just simply download it. The features are pretty interesting. Not all of these are with the free version. I personally just use the free version. I'm sure the paid version is very awesome, but I found that I get what I need out of the free one for now. We'll see how long that lasts. So this is the actual extension in Google Chrome. And you can see when you've typed in lose weight fast, you're going to see a lot of the stats, the details, and all of this, but what I like is you scroll on down a bit, and it's going to show you the top keyword phrases that go together with it. So lose weight fast, lose weight, and weight loss. These are all top three. Now here's another awesome little trick. You can do this enable inline keywords, and if you're putting together a video about losing weight fast, enable this feature, and it's going to show you all of the keywords these people are using in their videos. What you need to do then is go find a video that's similar to yours, or something you're wanting to put together, find out what they're using. You'll see that these are the top ranked 
videos on YouTube, so they're obviously using good keywords. And you pick the one you like. Let's say you like this one. Let's say this one most matches what you're trying to accomplish. We'll go in here and hit pause. We'll go ahead and scroll down and simply go down till you see the keywords right here. Right here, all the keywords. Come up here, copy to clipboard. Now I've copied every single one of their keywords. If I like somebody else's and theirs, I can combine the bunch, but you can see already, you can see it's ranking how good these keywords are based on their video and the content. Well, I hope that helps. That's all I got for you today. Hey, did you remember to subscribe?